understanding what conscious awareness is and why and how it evolved is one of the greatest mysteries known to science. This video is putting forward a very simple idea that electrical activity in the brain that forms conscious awareness is the most advanced part of a universal process of energy exchange. Electromagnetism is an innate part of all matter and if we take an everyday experience of looking at a tree we can have conscious awareness of the beauty of the color green but if our eyes were more sensitive to the different wavelengths of light rather than just visible light we would see that everything is white and radiating light just like the inside of a light bulb this represents a universal process of energy exchange that is universal because the universe is never at absolute zero there is always an analog stream of electromagnetic radiation the human eye is able to absorb a small portion of the electromagnetic spectrum to create the color we identify as green what is actually happening is the conversion of analog waves into digital form or photons relative to the structure of the eye in mainstream physics this is known as wave particle duality with light being a wave and a particle at the same time but in this theory the wave particle duality of light and matter in the form of electrons is forming a blank canvas that we can interact with forming a future relative to the energy and momentum of our own actions this process of energy exchange forms the ever-changing world of our everyday life that we see and feel as a passage of time the future is continuously unfolding photon by photon with each new photon energy oscillation or vibration only occurring once and then it is gone forever as a universal process the photon of quantum mechanics forms a movement of positive and negative charge with a continuous flow of electromagnetic fields therefore the electrical activity within the brain that forms conscious awareness must be unfolding photon by photon relative to the structure of the brain because of the great complexity of the brain this represents the most advanced part of a universal process that is aware of its own electrical potential each individual is in the moment of now in the center of their own reference frame within this process of continuous energy exchange or continuous creation from the center of our own reference frame we comprehend this process of continuous energy exchange that forms the ever-changing world of our everyday life as time with a past that is gone forever and an uncertain future that only exists as a probability wave function the future is unfolding photon by photon relative to the atoms of the periodic table forming what we see and feel as a period of time the flow of time as a process of continuous energy exchange and our consciousness as a flow of unbroken ever-changing flow of ideas feelings dreams hopes perceptions and emotions are interlinked in this theory it is because each individual is at the forefront of creation in the moment of now within the center of their own reference frame that we have the concept of mind with each one of us having our own personal view of the universe being able to look back in time in all directions at the beauty of the stars sensations are the building blocks of conscious awareness and are formed by environmental stimuli but in every case these environmental stimuli exist in wave form and are converted or recreated into photon form by cell life with the movement of positive and negative charge we have a republic of cells with each cell having the build-up and exchange of positive and negative charge across the membrane of the cell relative to the position and structure of the cell this is a totally universal process just as living cells in the eye can create photons 
relative to the waves of light that the eye comes in contact with. The atmosphere that the life form inhales and exhales also forms the exchange of photon energy with the diffusion of oxygen and carbon dioxide. The future is unfolding relative to each breath that we take and it is the same with our digestive systems with food releasing photon energy as it breaks down. One of the greatest effects this continuous process of energy exchange has on us is the aging process but above all this is a creative process. Every movement we make and every object we come in contact with there will be an exchange of photon energy with the future unfolding relative to the energy and momentum of our interactions. It is just the same for non-living objects. Water is a perfect example of this with hydrogen bonds breaking and reforming with the release and exchange of photon energy relative to the energy and momentum of the flowing water. This theory gives us a reason why life seems to have a mathematical base. It is because cell life is based on a dynamic geometry that is innate within the fabric of space and time. At the most fundamental level this is a process of symmetry forming and breaking. When we have the absorption and the emission of light we have photon electron couplings or dipole moments. The electron is the most spherical object in the universe and this forms a symmetry with a sphere having an infinite number of line symmetries that in this theory represents an infinite number of potential timelines or degrees of freedom. This spherical geometry can even be seen in these images from the International Space Station of a candle flame in zero gravity naturally forming a sphere that is interacting with the environment relative to the two-dimensional surface of the sphere. Mathematically a sphere is represented as 4 pi and we see 4 pi in the equation for Heisenberg's uncertainty principle representing the dynamic geometry of this process with an uncertain future continuously unfolding. Because this is a geometrical process the line symmetry or left and right handedness is part of the geometry of all intelligent life. All life that consciously forms its own evolutionary path will have line symmetry representing the timeline of that life form. This process forms greater degrees of freedom for entropy or disorganization and it also forms the energy and dynamic geometry for ever greater symmetry formation that we see in the creativity and diversity of cell life. We have the unity of one universal process, the same creative process of energy exchange relative to changes in atmosphere temperature forms variations in photon oscillations leading to infinite snowflake diversity with no two patterns of snowflakes being the same. The same process of symmetry forming and breaking forms the imperfect symmetries that are visible in nature. We have the chaos and uncertainty of everyday life formed by a geometrical process and the geometry of this broken symmetry can be seen in our everyday life as the Fibonacci spiral. This is because if the quantum wave particle function or probability function is reformulated as a linear vector each new vector is formed by adding the two previous vectors together this forms the Fibonacci sequence in this theory we even have an objective reason for the start of the Fibonacci numbers with the zero in the center of the diagram representing t equals zero the moment of now and the positive one and negative one representing the positive and negative of electromagnetic waves with everything being based on one geometrical process. We have the Fibonacci spiral in nature not because of economy of growth but because 
it is linked to the broken symmetry that forms the fabric of space-time. Therefore it is formed by anything over a period of time that has a vector. Like the direction of growth of a plant mathematically forms a linear vector, therefore we see the Fibonacci spiral in plant life. But everything that has a direction or linear vector has the potential to form the Fibonacci spiral. A beautiful example of this is this photo of a girl flicking her head with wet hair. The water comes off her hair and over a period of time forms a Fibonacci spiral. The universe is a continuum with a unity and oneness that can only be formed out of one universal process with gravity being a secondary force to the electromagnetic force. This unity can be seen mathematically with both the electromagnetic force and the gravitational force sharing the inverse square law, representing the same dynamic geometry. The interactive nature of this geometry forms a potential infinity of possibilities with creation in the hand and eye of the beholder. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and share. It will help the promotion of this theory that has the potential to change our view of the universe and our place within it.